Hi everyone, I'm Dr. Byam. I'm going to give you a quick overview of MedValley, our free VR training application. It's built to provide medical students with access to unlimited clinical training. So it essentially can go in any place, any time. It automatically tracks your score and the training that you receive is personalized based on AI to your needs. Essentially, students can put on a VR headset and practice their histories, physical exams, and soon procedures any place, any time. As you're seeing from the video, there's over 140 unique clinical interactions that can be performed on these virtual patients. So it gives you a lot of room to practice different things. Right now, MedValley is small, but it's growing. We've got around 600 medical students currently using it, and we release new updates every two weeks that usually include new cases or new features, like how we just released multiplayer, so you can actually start learning with friends in the same virtual environment. We're also just starting to form a community around the application. And so that essentially we can, one, support its development and growth by interacting with medical students and making sure it's what you need, but second, so that we can provide more value. So one, through things like headset giveaways, but also we're doing weekly bedside tutorials with Dr. Brian Carson. He's an emergency physician from the UK. Essentially, all of this is built for the purpose of providing you, the medical student, whether you're pre-med, medical student, postgraduate, with a personalized medical school for learning your clinical skills. I hope this has provided you with a good understanding of what we're trying to accomplish in MedValley. If you'd like to learn more about how to actually do some of these things in VR, we've got a free course. It doesn't require a VR headset, but you can go check that out on our website. Thanks for your time, and please feel free to reach out to us at any time to provide feedback or share what your vision for the future of medical education might be.